One of the UK's biggest wildlife charities has an uncertain future as its founder has been diagnosed with terminal cancer. Simon Cowell has spent most of his life saving animals. The Wildlife Aid Foundation Rescue Centre is based on land at his home in Leatherhead, but it will have to relocate once he passes away. Now, Simon's dying wish is to raise enough money to secure the charity's future. Sadly, I was diagnosed with small cell lung cancer less than a month ago. Um, it's treatable but not curable, and so this, this fundraiser for us is just absolutely critical. I don't know whether I've got to do this in weeks or months or how it's going to run, and I just want to get this done before I die. My name is Simon Cowell, I'm CEO of the Wildlife Aid Foundation, which has been running for about 40 years. And these are due to go back out for a while soon, we actually build them a starter home. We can save the animals, but I think it's so important for people to understand that it's no point us saving the animals if we don't keep the habitat intact. So from here, we, you know, we need to get children to understand not only what we do, which is the soul of wildlife aid, but to understand why we all need to protect the planet. And I was going to have a little peep at the badgers to see if they're all right. Following Dad's diagnosis, we've launched a campaign, Simon's Last Wish, to try and raise money to ensure the future of the charity. Our whole family are, are animal lovers. It's in the genes. We're all going with flat denial. That seems to be the most sensible route forward because how, how do you process that? He always seems to be on his own. This site is obviously my house and my daughter's inheritance and obviously the inheritance tax obviously will be quite high so we just couldn't afford to keep this site on anyway. Um, this site really has been too small for us for some time so we've been looking. I mean we started, I think the first site we bought back in 2014 so we, we knew we needed to move. All this has done is speeded up the timetable of that move. Oh, look, there oh, we go. He's off. He's off. It's very hard times at the moment. We've got Brexit, we've got Ukraine, we've got all these nasty things going on. So to try to raise money for it is proving incredibly difficult. Um, it should be so easy. I mean, if everybody in Surrey just gave us one pound, we'd be there. That's one of the world's best kept secrets, wildlife. So talk about it because it's so vital. And for me, I think if wildlife aid is able to continue, then, then my dad lives forever. And we wish them all the best.